guest is Melmark Magtuba. And thank you for giving me this privilege to be your presenters for today. But before that, we will go, I'm going to uh, extend my full thanks to my co-reporters, students, viewers, and especially to my uh, handsome and interactive professor, uh, Doctor of Education, uh, Sir Rogelio Moro. Sir, good morning. So, but before that, I would like to uh, ask my apology because of the noise interruption and the presentation of my slide because it might have a, a short issue with this. But don't worry, I will deliver you the uh, information correctly and hope you will be uh, get and gain knowledge with this. So please take note with the information that I am going to discuss to you today and uh, we will be going to, to uh, recall the uh, lesson that I will talk about. So we will going to proceed our demonstration. So guess what happened this? So get what, what's the picture shown or flash on the TV. So what is this? So as the proceeding of this lesson, so our lesson for today's uh, morning is all about school and community partnership. So guess what? What is school and community partnership? How it comes and how it is relevant and important nowadays in our community. So, okay, so objectives of our um, report is it defines what is school and community collaboration. Find the resources and supporting materials, possible outcomes and processes of school and community partnership, importance of school and community collaboration programs, contribution of the learning system to the students' social values and community. So, <clears throat> As what we, we tackled about communication or about collaboration of school and community. So collaboration are the common terms for school community cooperation. So it was been highlighted that uh, school and community cooperation or partnership is ideally such partnerships formally combined resources from at least one school and occasionally a group of school or an entire school district. So it was been combined to, to gather resources or to gather um, another um, departments of uh, institution to, to support the learning uh, system of the students. So with resources from a specific area or a larger community, the goal is to keep this relationship going for a long period of time. So that's it. So, community and partnerships are agreements between school and nonprofit groups to provide programs or services to the kids that complement their educational experience. So, it is, uh, it is a goal or it is an aim to, to focus the knowledge of the students that we, we try to uh, communicate with school and the community. So. After schools extended days and summer programs are common example of collaboration. For example, with that is a, a summer tutorial. Um, how about a? Uh, what are those um, activities that the students might engage? A uh, another further uh, lesson learning with uh, collaboration with communities. So. Next is sociological basis of school community partnership to the school and churches and other social institutions come in to assist parents and families to fulfill their irreplaceable obligation. So by that, the first goal of or the first um, steps of learning of the students is come from their homes, come from the teaching method of their parents. And the next one is the teaching method of the school and their teachers. So the negative effects of uncontrolled and un unregulated use of technology on the young. So by without uh, mis um, misleading or the mis um, 
guiding of the students using technology. So nowadays is um, which which is relevant the the use of technology. So but using that without the proper um, proper um, guidance, so it was been lead mislead to them to you to use the technology. It would be uh, it would be give them a negative uh, impact with. Uh, the use of that uh, materials so next is so it is described what school community partnership are and the evidence where whether partnerships can promote students social and emotional well-being and their academic success it's further reflects on how districts and school can expand so that is the the uh, job of the school and community partnership so they will be combined each other to support the learning or to support the the needed um, knowledge of the students so it is discussed how school district can use partnership with outside organization and agencies to help provide additional services so what are the example of those um, organization and partnership so between uh, so for example is between school and Department of Agriculture or Department of uh, uh, no not the department but Bureau of um, Fire Prevention it's a kind of a sources or a kind of a, um, organization that supports to the learning of the students so it will give them another settings of information to make their knowledge um, improved and it will be a how do I say this uh, it will be give them more development of learning so partner organization can help schools and district build a strengthened healthy learning environments by bringing in additional programs and services and providing additional opportunities for school to connect with families and other local community members so that is the first um first uh, stream on how the students gain their learning so it will be first come from their parents or it probably comes from their home the learning of their homes the guidance of their parents and their families so the second one is the organization which is it will be combining or it will be accessing the the other resources to make this the learning of the students may grow or develop more so it was been cited that the link this link is uh, given the full source so please take note with that it was been Susan Sepanik and Kevin uh, Tyrius Brown by the M uh, MDCR our MDRC buildings knowledge to improve social policy that the school and community partnership so you can you if you want to, to read a, a lot of or you, would, you want to read another resources of information you can visit this link next okay so this picture show how growing community and school partners partnership is so by that we will be focused or by that the community and school focuses the importance of the learning of the student so next so this partnership to assess school transformation at three levels so the one is the program levels second is staff level third one is weaving in practical advices from district leaders with successful districts wide partnership system okay next so now we are asking what are the school community partnership so there's a lot of uh, resources or there's a lot of uh, information written but i am just trying to cite you or give you the factual or the broad information for you to to be uh, guided with this so there's there are respectful and collaborative partnership between school and outside organization partners can provide academic uh, enrichment activities tutoring and behavior supports health and social services and family and community engagement 
Now, let's proceed on. School community partnerships have been proven to be effective. First is, it is give a stronger social and emotional skills development. Okay, take note with that. Second, it enhances students' engagement or it will be give them or it will be a uh, result for them uh, getting a higher attendance rates and lower chronic of absenteeism. The third one, it improves academic outcomes. For the students, it will gain or it will uh, result as they will get higher test scores and better grades, higher rates of on-time grades pronoun promotion, and higher graduation rates. Okay, so nowadays in my uh, time or in my uh, present day with my uh, colleagues and classmates, so there's a lot of uh, students trying to drop out their uh, programs and because they, they don't know how to manage their time, they don't know how to, to uh, select their programs or managing their um, tasks. But by this community and school partnerships can improve with that. It will give them a further information, a further assistance to make them uh, to finish their activities their, uh, uh, for having their development skills and knowledge. Okay, so next. So partner partnership have three levels. So first is it provides additional learning experiences inside and outside their normal school day. All right. So the next one is offer individual supports for students and their families. The third one is supply additional opportunities for meaningful relationships with adults. In addition, we have another one, the creative, deeper connections with families and communities. So just uh, be guided with this and um, just follow the statement and, and how it will be connected with our uh, discussion. Okay. So the next is, District can strengthen partnership at the staff level by first is including partners, organization, and staff training related to social and emotional well-being, restorative behavioral practices, and equity. So the third and the second one, creating district and school level positions to manage relationships and poster schools and partners communication or partner communication. The third one is providing school principals and other administrators with guidance and training needed to make partners successful. Okay. So then, so, go. So as what you see in the pictures, so I'm so sorry it was so very blurred and, but take note, it was being a community between community and the college of uh, how they say this oh, not college but it is a school premises and the community it was been combined it was been a partnership or an, a kind of uh, agreement to collaborate with okay so what are the benefits of school community partnership so school and community groups for partnerships to serve a shared goals of helping students effective partnerships achieve the, that goal by creating programs uh, that expand a school's presence in community and giving students greater access to resources outside of the classroom so that's we can apply the community resources that's how it will be explained okay so that's so on this illustration so just look on this illustration so this is the, the basic pattern of how community and school partnerships uh, collided or collaborate so this is the school uh, personnel or this is maybe the school or the teachers and the professors this is the family and this is the community so by that uh, they connected ones in the center so the center is the students or the school or the learners so 
with this illustration we can gather we can be uh, imagined oh that is the the purpose of the collaboration with school and community so partnership between school and community groups require input and cooperation from many stakeholders including school and district officials teachers and parents so careful preparation and planning can be help education leaders attain early buy-in when attempting to create and expand a community partnership right now the question is there's a big question there okay so why is family and community partnerships important in education so think of that what is the basic common or the basic common sense of this uh, question so according to troy it all february 22 2022 that the link between school families and community members and academic achievements and success has been shown to be positive it is also true that families encouragement and information about students taking rigorous classes leads to more enrolled students and higher test score okay that's how or that's the important or that's the base uh, the uh, how do i say this that's the the purpose the purpose of uh, community and school or school and community partnership or collaboration next so why are partnerships in family schools important no so why why so now having positive relationships between school and families will be played an important role in promoting the development and success of the children children who benefit from working with teachers and parents together are able to develop social take note with that develop social emotional and academic competencies okay so hope you will be uh, take note with this uh, information okay so next is why are community partnerships important to school oh so there's a big difference with these two questions right so students have an improved opportunity to learn by partnering with a local organization as a result of sharing resources experiences and environments a good academic relationship between school and families can be beneficial so students achieve outcomes such as going to school when school parents families and communities unite the longer you stay in school the more motivated you are okay so next oh so this is an example of how community and organization or outside organization and school um, collaboration so okay so next okay so that's also thank you so much for watching so my my slide show is will be end to so those uh, pictures so i hope you gain some uh, uh, information or a broad information about school and community partnership so i was be happy to be part of this uh, growing institution and it was been my pleasure to present to you my uh, short uh, report about school and community partnership so by this uh, information i have been shown you recently is it is gave you it will be gave you a further um exploration on how you you understand and relates the uh, importance of the students learning from the resources from school from community from family and from the environment that we have been uh, living today so in that case we will be uh, going to to expand or explore more information about community and or no 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 not community but school and community collaboration or school community partnership so 
Thank you so much, you guys, for listening and uh, watching my uh, short tutorial, or not tutorial, but short uh, demonstration about, excuse me, about my uh, school and community partnership. So, hope you, you take notes, the information, and um, the courage to, to develop your knowledge within yourself, within your your own. So it is. This is just only a a what is this? It is only a, a practice, or it is also a a guide for you to know what uh, uh, the importance of school and community partnership. So how you you give me a thumbs up and like share and subscribe my channel so i will be uploading this to my channel youtube channel and i will be uploading also this to my uh structures affiliates program in the uh, our group chat and google classroom so thank you so much guys so i give hands for everyone and to our presenter of course me and may god bless you all and stay safe. Hope that every one of you are uh, doing great today, tomorrow, and the future. So, goodbye!